Hello, good morning, dear students. How are you today? Welcome to class. My name is David Luafemi. We want to learn about the roads, signs, and traffic lights in religion and national value, civic education. Let's go. At the end of this class, you should be able to mention three traffic lights, mention the meaning of the Ships of uh, three ships of road sign should be able to lead the purpose of road signs and traffic light and, and to identify road signs and their meanings. Now, road signs and their meanings. There are several road signs a symbol with their respective meaning, a great number of them, numerous, but it's good for us to understand the meaning. Now, there are three types of root sign symbols, I mean shapes. Now, the one of it, root sign, there are, there are three types of them. One is for instruction and other signs. They are instruction or other signs. Two, warning, warning signs. And three are information signs. Now, the word, those of instruction sign or other sign do you circle circle you see them they are written in circle now those that are rectangular shape rectangle is used for information there are some root signs that are meant for information then there are triangle shape used for warning they are used for warning As you can see in those things you see various shapes there you see this triangular shape, I mean rectangular shape, rectangular shape, triangular, it's just some circular shape there. All right. Now, the purpose of road signs and traffic light is to reduce occurrence of accidents, to guide and protect every road user. Road user could be a, somebody driving a, a, a truck, somebody driving a car, somebody pushing a truck, somebody riding a bicycle or using a motorbike, or even pedestrians. Pedestrians are those who are walking on their feet. And to achieve and maintain order in the traffic, so everybody walk or move in order, means it's their own time, when it is their own time. All right, for safety of lives and properties so that things are not damaged or lost. Okay, now let's look at uh, some of those those signs and symbols. As you can see, see this U, inverted U, see this one turning to the right and crossing, uh, and they are crossed, so they are crossed. And look at this one, example. Let's look at the meanings. Now, this one that you see there, it means stop ahead. And stop ahead and stop at the place that is, there's a sign on the, on the road where you should stop. Right? Stop then, move when safe to do so. This one is saying give way to traffic approaching from left or right. This one says no entry. Entry forbidden for all vehicles. This one says road closed. Road forbidding to all drivers, to all vehicles. This one, you can see they are crossed. Entry forbidding to motor vehicles, that is all motor vehicles, with more than two wheels. This one is talking about entry forbidding to all motorcycles without a sidecar. This one is talking about entry forbidding for all bicycles. This one says entry forbidden for 
or pedestrian. Pedestrians are those who are walking on their feet. All right? Entry forbidden for all motorcycles, for all motor vehicles. All right? This one is entry forbidden for all uh, uh, motor vehicles, animal drawn vehicles. As you can see. All right? Now, this one is talking about entry forbidden to all vehicles exceeding two meters width. This is entry forbidden to all vehicles exceeding three, three exceeding the exceeding the height. Right? Entry forbidden to all vehicles exceeding the height. Right? In the height, you can see that it's up and down. This one is side. Talking about which the horn up and down is talking about the height. Right? This one is saying no left turn. In other words, turn left turn prohibited for all vehicles. This one, no right turn. This one, no U turn. This one, no overtaking of any four wheel vehicle by any four wheel vehicle. Okay? Now, talking about the traffic lights and their meaning, there are three traffic lights. We have red, we have green, there's yellow or amber, and the red one says stop, green says go. The yellow or amber says slow down or proceed with caution. Slow down or proceed with caution. All right, I believe you learned something this morning and you should be able to recall. You should be able to mention three traffic lights. You should be able to mention the, you should be able to mention the main or the three shapes of those signs. You should be able to list the purpose of road signs and traffic lights. And you should be able to identify some road signs and their meanings. Thank you for listening and bye for now.